I'm in charge of a very important special. I need someone to pick up workmen, he puffed importantly. Rusty was very excited. I can collect the workmen, he hooted happily. But Sir Handel wasn't listening. I must find the very best engines, he huffed. Wait here. Then Sir Handel found Duncan and Peter Sam. They were racing down some twisty tracks. I'm in charge of a very important special. I need a fast engine to take a train to Thomas at the yards, chuffed Sir Handel importantly. We can pull trains faster than any other engine, Duncan and Peter Sam puffed excitedly. But Sir Handel wasn't listening. I must find the very best engines, Sir Handel steamed snootily. You must wait here. So the little engines pulled into a siding. Sir Handel felt more important than ever. Then there was trouble. Sir Handel arrived back at the transfer yards. Thomas had already arrived to collect the special. Where's my train? tooted Thomas. Bust my buffers, cried Sir Handel. Sir Handel had spent so long looking for the very best engines, nothing had been done. Now he was very worried. Your special isn't ready, he wheezed sadly to Thomas. Thomas was surprised. Can you find engines to start work right away, he tooted. Then I can still deliver the special on time. This time Sir Handel was listening, very carefully. He knew where all the engines were waiting. If I hurry, I can put engines to work right away. Leave it to me, Thomas, he chuffed. And Sir Handel raced out of the yards. Sir Handel steamed over to Duncan and Peter Sam. Can you work on my special, he asked. We can pull the train along the twisty tracks to the forest, peeped Peter Sam. Faster than anyone, added Duncan. This time Sir Handel was listening. Please, start straight away, he wished. And he raced off to find Rusty. Rusty was still where Sir Handel had told him to wait. I can collect the workmen, hooted Rusty, and take them to load the lumber. Please, start straight away, Sir Handel huffed. Finally, Sir Handel found Mighty Mac. We can pull the heavy lumber train to the transfer yards, wished Mighty. We're the strongest, whistled Mac. And they steamed off. Sir Handel had listened carefully to everyone. Now everyone was working. The special will be ready for Thomas after all, he huffed. Later, at the transfer yards, Thomas's freight cars had been loaded with the lumber. Just then, James returned with Mr. Percival. Well done, Sir Handel, said Mr. Percival. Did you enjoy being the engine in charge? Yes, sir, shoved Sir Handel. He felt very happy. He had listened to the other engines, and now he was even wiser. <laughs>